Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Sarah here and today we are going to be looking at the new Jorvik Wilds uh, that were released today. Talina and Campus I believe they are called. Uh, they're just down by uh, Fort Pinta so we'll head on there real quick as well as looking at the new Flying Panda Ray pets which I am super excited about. Uh, I didn't think they were going to be released today. I thought they were coming later because the, the teaser didn't say a release date, but makes sense that they were going to be released today. Uh, as well as discussing changes to the prices over at Ferdinand's Horse Market and the new horse that is going to be coming soon-ish. Uh, so with that, let's head on over. All right, and of course there's a massive crowd here. Um, okay, so here is Talina and Campus. Now, I have a name for Talina here, um, but not for Campus. So let's check out Talina first. Oh, I love how they're like distracted, easily distracted by shiny things. That's adorable. Okay, so this horse is 800, they're 850 star coins, so let's just get to buying. Uh, I did not decide to name her Sea Queen af um, after a Zora Queen from the Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess, Rutella. Uh, I'm a huge Legend of Zelda fan, as some of my friends may know. And I immediately knew that I was going to name her. Okay, now for Campus here. Campos? Campos. Okay, so they're named after the Hippocampus. Okay, that makes sense. I figured so. I figured so, because that name sounded familiar. Okay. So now I need to figure out a name for this one. Ocean Spell sounds nice. I like that. I don't have a nickname for it this one, but I like that name, Ocean Spell. Okay, I think that's what I'm gonna go with. Okay, with that out of the way, I'm going to make one final purchase of these adorable, adorable little, little flying rays. Oh, they're so cute. Okay, so they're 400 star coins, Um, which I can't remember if that's the most expensive pet. Hold on, let me check real quick. Okay, so these pets are not the most expensive. It's actually, the um, the snow fox and the red mist fox are actually the most expensive. So um, that's not too bad, especially since these ones fly um, and they have like a new unique design. So yeah, you can also get these if you buy the bundle, which I did last time with the cat and the fox for the Ayla and Umbra horses. Um, but I'm not gonna do that this time because I don't feel like spending real, more, real money. <laughs> Um, at the moment, so let's just quickly purchase these darlings. In you go. And this one. Okay, thank you once again, Gary Goldtooth. Pleasure doing business with you. Okay, so we have the Shimmery Panda Ray and the Pearly Panda Ray. So I'm quickly going to go back to my stable and check out the new horses and their flying pets. Okay, so here we have Sea Queen and Ocean Spell, and oh my gosh. Oh, their designs are just so cool. I mentioned in my in my reaction uh, to the teaser for these horses that, like, I wasn't as excited for these ones as I thought I would be, but looking at them now, I'm, like, super impressed with their mane and just all their, like, fins and stuff. Like, it's so cool. I also like how they're not like the same coat, just different colors. Like they have the same kind of um, marking around the eye that's like a starfish. If I could, there, sort of, ah, there you go. Um, but like this coat is obviously, it kind of reminds me of a, of more of a fish, like I think a swordfish or a, or a sailfish kind of coat. Um, whereas this one obviously has like the, the shell marking on the side. Uh, now, which one of you am I gonna take out? Two. I think I'm gonna do, I guess I'm gonna do Sea Queen first, uh, cause I really like Sea Queen's city coat. So I'm gonna get you quickly tacked up and then take you out. I'm not gonna do anything fancy for the tack. 
um, right now because I just kind of want to get the horse shown off. I'll figure out a good tax set later. Oh, it has a starfish on its back. Let me see. Oh my gosh, it does! There's a little starfish on its back. Oh my gosh, that's cute. Um, but here is Rutella and she, I love her city coat. Like I love, love, love it. It's my favorite for sure. All right, let's see. Let's get far away enough that we can put on her magic coat. How far away do I have to get for your magic coat? And there we go. Oh, the sparkles are different. Okay. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, it's just that one small area, I guess. I actually love that they use the Alteke uh, model because it definitely, it definitely works better. Like, I don't think this would have worked on any other model. It All right, so let's check out some of the animations for the panda ray. Uh, what do you do other than just fly around? Come on. You gotta do something. Oh, it does a little turn in the air. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's really cute. Oh, I like that. It's so cute. Honestly, this might be one of my favorite pets. Other than my cat zucchini, like these panda rays might be my favorite pets. They're just so darn cute. I'm definitely gonna have to get pictures of these guys in Pandoria later. Um, so I'll probably be spamming those on my Instagram and Tumblr, a link for which are down below. Um, all right, let's try out, oh yeah, let's try out the campus. Okay. I've heard some people say that the campus's um, coat, like its city coat is mirrored, um, which is odd because the Talina's doesn't seem to be mirrored. So we'll try, we'll check that out. Um, I hope it's not mirrored because that would be a real shame. And just gonna throw on the same tack set as before. So I don't have time to figure out a new one. And your shivering panda, uh, panda ray pet. That is gonna be quite the tongue twister for me. Oh, it jumps up in the, in the, oh, it jumps up like that. That is so cute. I think it'll be better if I actually take off the tack for a minute, just so I can at least, at least the saddle and the saddle blanket so I can actually see. Um. No, it doesn't look like it's, it doesn't, it's not mirrored. Nope. It just looks like it is because it has like, it follows the same design pattern um, kind of as its markings in wild mode, like the, the lines down the side, it kind of mirrors that. But no, it's definitely, it's definitely not. It's definitely not mirrored, which is good. I'm glad to hear that. All right, I'm just gonna quickly, yeah. I don't know which one of these I'm gonna train first. Um, either Ocean Spell or Rutella, I do not know yet. But yeah, so that's mostly it for today. Oh, right, um, the, the, far, the horse market has some price changes. Um, I can't remember the list off the top of my head. Um, but uh, you can see the full list on the Friends app or on news page on SSO's website. So definitely check that out. Um, and also the English Thoroughbred is going to be the next updated horse breed. I am actually surprised. I thought it was going to be the Appaloosas and um, Paints because they all got moved. To the horse market but no they're doing the uh they're doing the thoroughbreds next and i have a couple of the old mall thoroughbreds i have the flea bitten gray and have the chestnut i'm really hoping the chestnut gets a good upgrade because i actually really like that horse i really like that coat uh so it'll be nice to have an updated uh version of it uh no idea what it looks like we got the silhouette but that's it so that'll be interesting for sure and next week, some summer stuff is going to be happening. Uh, I'm not sure if it's mid gonna be midsummer yet. I think it's still too early for that. Maybe it isn't though, I cannot remember. 
Um, but we'll have to see. Maybe it's the Fort Pinta beach party. Actually, that, that would make sense if it was the Fort Pinta. No, it wouldn't because the horses are in that area. Okay, so maybe it's not. Maybe it is going to be. Who knows? We'll have to see next week. Uh, so that is it for today. As always, my name is Sarah. This is my channel. If you liked what you see, please like, comment, and subscribe to stay up to date on all my content. Um, I will be... I update relatively every Wednesday, give or take. I am still figuring out uh, other videos to do. Uh, if you have suggestions, please let me know in the comments below. And I all hope you all have a fantastic week. Bye!